Today's video will be on the parts of a microscope and their functions. In this video, we will take a closer look at the main components of a typical compound microscope and explain their roles. A typical compound microscope is composed of several key parts, including the base, arm, stage, objectives, eyepiece, focusing knobs, light source, and condenser. Each of these parts plays a vital role in helping us observe tiny specimens. The base is on which the microscope sits on a surface. It provides stability and support for the entire instrument. The arm is the curved or straight vertical part that connects the base to the head of the microscope. It allows you to carry and hold the microscope securely. The head, also known as the body tube, houses the microscope's optical components. The eyepiece and objectives are located in the head, just like we have our eyes located close to head. The eyepiece is the lens you look through when using the microscope. It typically provides a 10x magnification and is where you observe the specimen. This can be adjusted according to our eyes by rotating. The nose piece is a rotating component that holds the objective lenses. You can easily switch between different objectives by turning the nose piece. The objectives are a set of lenses positioned below the head in the nose piece. Each objective lens offers different levels of magnification, typically ranging from 4x to 100x. The stage is the flat platform, where you place your specimen for observation. It often includes a slide holder and stage clips to secure your slides in place. Some microscopes have a mechanical stage with controls that allow you to precisely move the specimen horizontally and vertically. These controls make it easier to navigate your sample. To sharpen the image of your specimen, you use the focusing knobs. The coarse adjustment knob is for rough focusing, and the fine adjustment knob is for fine tuning the focus. The condenser is located beneath the stage and is responsible for focusing light onto the specimen. It can be adjusted to control the amount and angle of light that reaches the specimen. A light source, often located in the base of the microscope, provides the necessary illumination for your specimen. It can be adjusted according to your need by a regulator. And there you have it, an overview of the main parts of a compound microscope and their functions. I'll show you how to focus an object in microscope in my next video soon. Thank you for joining us in this educational journey. Have a good day.